Right, so we all know about AVIDs and markers. We use them to keep notes, colour code, mark specific moments in the timeline, and we can export them as a text document to hand over to online. It's awesome, but did you know that you can actually make markers that span a specific duration of the timeline and not just mark one frame? Yep, they're called spanned markers. Nicely named, and here's how you make them. Just mark an in and an out point on your timeline, and then hold the Alt or Option key, depending on your Mac or Windows, and when you hit your Add Marker button, and hey presto, you've made a span marker. With these, you can track the in and out of a region, name it, colour code them, break an episode of a program into parts, and when you export, you even get a duration of the span region in frames. It's pretty useful, right? Now, one caveat to note here is that if you trim shots or otherwise change the duration of the spanned marked sequence, then you may have to recreate your spanned marker in order to get accurate beginning and end points. This is because the span marker doesn't have a sync lock and won't remember the exact beginning and end.